Hey, how's it going today, guys? This is Rubik's Pie, and welcome back to another episode of Portal 2. Hmm, I was kind of expecting some dialogue there, but I have that guy there, and I have that guy there. That seems like it's going to be incredibly useful for me. Probably not. What am I waiting for? What's going on? Ah. Well then, let's use that to break that, I guess. <laughs> All right, come flying through, bombs. Bombs away. Woohoo! <laughs> Perfect. Does this help me in any way? Maybe. Maybe. Can I do one of these? No. That, is that an invisible wall? Hold on. I need to find this out. Yeah, that's an invisible wall. <laughs> oh well, okay. Oh, I guess it it made it so that I can travel over there because I couldn't get to any of these. Never mind, I understand now. Never mind. All right, that's cool. That, that's a good time. That's a good time. Sector two. Welcome to sector two. If you're not familiar with sector two, is where all the sexy fun time happens. Ah, there you are. Yay! Okay. And I'll push this button to counter your catwalk. Killer. Okay. I'll be honest, the death traps have been a bit of a failure so far for both of us. I think you'll agree. And you are getting very close to my lair. Yep. Lair. It's weird in that first time I said it out loud. It sounds a bit, it sounds a bit ridiculous, really. But uh, I can assure you, it is one. It is a proper lair, deadly lair. And uh, I just wanted to give you the chance to kill yourself now before you get to the lair. Oh, well, uh, why would I do that? that masher, just there. Uh, less a death trap, more a death option for you. Sounds crazy, I know, but hear me out, hear me out. Once you get to my lair, death will not be optional, all right? It will be mandatory. No tricks, no smasher will kill you. I feel like so this is endless dialogue. <laughs> I don't know if this is the way I'm supposed to be doing this, but... Oh, no, I don't think so. I think it's bumping me back. Hold on, is it bumping me back? Yeah, it is. Okay, that's not the way I'm supposed to do it then. Uh, this did what? I pushed this already. Oh, okay. So we could do that and that. That should work. I didn't see that before. Huh. Oh, okay, okay. So we will do something like... Come on. Give me good placement. Now that works. That works. Now you go up. You blow up that line. Oh. I guess I gotta move it. Whoa. Okay. <laughs> that works, I guess. Now what does that do for me? makes everything slick all over the place. That keeps going. Um, then we can go here. Yes. And now I should be able to run, right? Would that make sense? Yeah. Sure does. Okay, I'll take that as a no then. <laughs> okay, cool. Whoa. That's a cool shot. Oh, it's so beautiful. Aww. Destruction has a beauty to it, it would seem. Alright, so what do we need to do? I need to get myself up here somehow, so I guess... Oh. Hi. You're still doing stuff. <laughs> There's still slime everywhere. Good to know. Good to know. Uh... Huh. Ah, so this coats this. Oh, that's perfect. That's perfect. Okay. Yay, I figured this one out quickly. I like when I figure these out quickly. Woohoo! Oh, shit. Well. <laughs> well, then. Oh, crap. I gotta move you a little bit over. Okay, now we're good. Whee! Perfect. Uh, I love being inside these beams. They're very, very tranquil. It's like being 
put back into the womb. Nope. Probably. Okay, cutscene! Yes! Love a good cutscene. For that's not, this isn't even a cutscene. This is a loading screen. I know what's what. I am in a spot. Ah, yes. Hi yo! Woo! Woohoo! Alright. Okay. Uh, this seems very endgame-ish. I think, I feel like I've said that, oh, this seems like endgame, like, 20 times now. <laughs> yeah, revenge. Okay. I'm pretty sure it's a problem with the light. I think the light's on the blink, but just in case it isn't, I am actually going to have to kill you, um, as discussed earlier. Yes. So let's call that three minutes and then a minute break, but we should leave allegedly two minutes to figure out how to shut down whatever is starting all the fires. So anyway, that's the itinerary. <laughs> also, I took the liberty of watching the tapes of you killing her, and I'm not going to make the same mistakes. Four-part plan is this. One, no portal surfaces. Two, start the neurotoxin immediately. Aww. Three, Bomb-proof shields for me, leading directly onto number four, bombs. Throwing it. You know what? This plan is so good, I'm going to give you a sporting chance and turn off the neurotoxin. I'm joking, of course. Goodbye. Neurotoxin level at capacity in five minutes. Oh. Where are you going? Don't run! Don't run! I'll tell you why you should run. The harder you breathe, the more neurotoxin you'll inhale. It's bloody clever. This is <laughs> Thanks, Waitley. Appreciate it. Sounded real. No, that was actually an impression of you. Actually, because you just fell into my trap, my brilliant trap. Yeah. I wanted you to trick me into bursting that pipe. Didn't trick you, trick me, seeing you trick me to give you. This is pretty similar to the GLaDOS fight, where you have to basically trick the laser into shooting her. Okay. Oh, I see, I see. Um, can I even get up there? How do I, how do I get there? Oh, I can get up there, okay. Huh, catwalk, come on, get here, sweet. All right, you're going to space, buddy. All right, what am I? What am I? Whoops! Didn't mean to walk through that. What? Where am I putting this? Where are you going? Will you shut up? There we go. Okay. More corruption at fifty percent. Bed system compromised. Neurotoxin offline. Reactor explosion in four minutes. What happened? Nothing. What happened? Nothing. What, 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 what have you, what have you to me? I didn't do nothing. Hold on. Ah, uh, the bloody bombs are stuck on. Doesn't matter. I've reconfigured the shields. Oh, it's a core you pawned me. Who told you to do that? Was it her? It's just making me stronger, love. It's a fool's errand. There. Uh, I first told you how to find that little portal thing you love so much. Well, I thought you'd die on the way, if I'm honest. All the others did. You didn't think you were the first, did you? Ha ha ha! No, no, no! Fifth! No, I lied! Sixth! Perhaps it's best to leave it to your imagination what happened to the other five. You know what? I think we're- ah! There we go! Got him from underneath! <laughs> I'm trying to pay attention to this dialogue as I'm doing this, but I'm also thinking. <laughs> Quick! What's the situation? Oh, hey. Thinking's a hard thing to do, I know. Are you out having yourself a little adventure? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. 
All right. A uh, boing and a grab. Yeah. I'll do what I can to cover you. Doesn't bother me. Gotta say the use mighty nice from right here. Man, that clock is beat. All right, there we go. Cool. Core corruption at 75%. Reactor explosion timer destroyed. Reactor explosion uncertainty emergency preemption protocol initiated. This facility will self-destruct in two minutes. No! Ow! Ow! That hit me right in the face! It was not a good idea! Okay. Now he's guarding himself on all those areas and not the back. So Okay, I think that we can get it here. Just come over here. Come over here. Yeah, I got him. Woohoo! Alright, cool. Uh where is it? Where is the core? Ah, I see it. Where are you gonna place that? Oh, that's gonna be a hard place to go. Oh, I didn't even notice. I didn't even notice this. Okay. So, how can we use this to get somewhere? Oh, because I have that. Okay, cool. Oh, I ran out of time. Damn it. <laughs> Shit. Now I know what to do. Perfection. I think that'll work. Let's do it. Hoyo. Hello! Before the invention of scrambled eggs in 1912, the typical breakfast was either. There we go! Core corruption at 100%. Cool. Manual core replacement required. Oh, I see. <laughs> Substitute core. Are you ready to start? Corrupted core. Are you ready to start? What do you think? Interpreting vague answer as yes. detected. <laughs> 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 Fire detected in the stalemate resolution annex. Extinguishing. Yay! Oh, that cleans right off, does it? Well, that would have been good to know a little earlier. Oh, oh no! Please press the stalemate resolution button. Do not press that button. Where is it? No! Do not do it! Where is the resolution button? It's not here. I don't see the button! Oh, over here. Okay. No, do not press that button. I gotta, I gotta do something, Weedly. This, <laughs> this place is gonna blow up if I don't do something. I need to do something. Oh shit! Oh god! Well, I went flying. I am. Well, oh, high moon. Oh, shit. Space. Oh, shit. Oh, did I actually do that? <laughs> I can still fix this! I already fixed it. And you are not coming back. Oh no! Change your plans! Hold on to me! Tighter! Ah! Grab me! Grab me! No! Wheatley! Yeah. Hey, GLaDOS saved us. Oh my! How's it going? Oh, thank God, you're all right. I am alive. You know, being Carolyn taught me a valuable lesson. I thought you were my greatest enemy, when all along you were my best friend. Aww. The surge of emotion that shot through me when I saved your life taught me an even more valuable lesson. Where Carolyn lives in my brain. Carolyn, delete. Goodbye, Carolyn. Oh shit. You know, Deleting Carolyn just now taught me a valuable lesson. 
the best solution to a problem is usually the easiest one. And I'll be honest, killing you is hard. You know what my days used to be like? I just tested. Nobody murdered me, or put me in a potato, or fed me to birds. I had a pretty good life. And then you showed up, you dangerous, mute, lunatic. So you know what? You win. Yay! Just go. Woohoo! It's been fun. Don't come back. I wish I could move my mouse around. Oh, hi. Yeah, we're friends. I know these guys. <laughs> Yay. That's adorable. I love you turrets. It's like a whole turret choir. Oh, it's the outside world. This has always been my dream. Goddamn. Yay! Companion cube! Ooh, what is this? Too much space. Need a zero. <laughs> I wish I could take it all back. I honestly do. I honestly do wish I could take it all back. And not just because I'm stranded in space. I know who you are, mate. <laughs> yeah, we're both in space. Anyway, you know, if I was ever to see her again, do you know what I'd say? Anything. I'd say, I'm sorry. Sincerely. I am sorry I was bossy and monstrous. And I am genuinely sorry. The end. <laughs> I believe you, Wheatley. Oh, poor Wheatley. He got corrupted by power and then resides in space for the rest of his life. I was actually surprised by the whole uh, lunar thing that you could uh, that you could shoot the moon, which makes sense because the white goop, as uh, Cave Johnson was explaining, was actually from uh, from moon dust, right? I think that's what it was. <laughs> but anyways, that's going to do it for both this uh, episode and this series. Hopefully you did enjoy. I had a lot of fun. This game is absolutely amazing. Um, one thing that I want to mention is uh, on Steam. I don't know when it's coming out, but there's the new like community made. I don't know if it's a campaign or what. Uh, it's, uh, what is it called? Mel? Portal Stories! Mel! That's what it's called. That, 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 that's the one that I was looking for. It's coming out in a quarter two, um, 2015, which means sometime in the next three months or so, so who knows, but I'd be very interested in playing that. It looks kind of interesting just based on the trailer that's on Steam right now, but, um, yeah, anyways, that's gonna do it for Portal 2, so hopefully you guys uh, did enjoy. I did. This game was a lot of fun. Uh, anyways, thank you guys so much for hanging out with me today. Hopefully you did enjoy, and I will see you in the next one. Goodbye!